Hey guys, I am Dara and welcome back to my channel for another video and it is vlogmas day two. Today I'm doing another bookish video and I'm going to be doing like in my November wrap up but I'm going to combine it with the Tome Toppler challenge um, wrap up as well because they don't need their own videos, it's fine. November was such a good reading month for me. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and get started and I'm not gonna really do descriptions or anything because I did actually read a lot of books and I don't want this video to be too terribly long. So we'll start with the Tome Toppler and if you guys didn't know, um, real quick, it is a challenge to read as many big books as you can, like books over 500 pages um, in a two week span. And so, I did two week, two books. I was hoping for three, but I was pretty much expecting to only get done two. So I read The Stand by Stephen King, which got I gave it three out of five stars, and then Sleeping Beauties by Stephen and Owen King, and I gave that one four out of five stars. I was hoping to get to 11.22.66, I think. Um, didn't quite make it, but that's okay. And um, so out of those two weeks, I got 1,874 pages read, but since I do audio, it amounted to 73 hours of listening to the books. So now I did that in November, so the next books I'm going to add on just <clears throat> for my November wrap up. So I also read The Quilter's Kitchen and The Spy, Mitri and the Spy Mistress by Jennifer Chavarini. Um, the Quilter's Kitchen, I only gave two out of five stars. It wasn't. It wasn't a regular book. The Spy Mistress I gave three out of five stars. So I also read Harry Potter and the Deathly Hallows. So the last one in the series. I'm sad that I'm done reading them, but I gave that book five out of five stars. And then I also read Siege and Storm and Ruin and Rising. Those are two separate books by Lee Bardugo. Those are the number two and number three in the Grisha series. Oh my gosh, I love her. Um, I gave Siege and Storm 4 out of 5 and I gave Ruin and Rising 5 out of 5. So good. So good. Read that series. Um, okay, and so pages total for November would have been, it was 3,714. Like I said, it was such a good month and um, I'm, um, I'm hoping it is just as good, if not better, because I'm going to take a week off from crocheting and I'm just gonna like read like instead of listen to books I'm just gonna like actually read some books so I'm excited to do that excited to see what I get accomplished and yeah so that is how my reading went in November and if you read any of these books not just in November but like in general then let me know in the comments what you thought of them I hope you guys enjoyed this video make sure to subscribe and thank you for coming back for another video and I'll see you on my next one bye